well, how can Jesus be God? And he was called the son of God. Well, he was a father of creation of the Old Testament where his name used to be Jehovah, who called Moses on the burning bush. In Exodus chapter number three, verse 14, he said, I am that I am. Now go to the New Testament. 66 books of the Bible, 39 books of the Old Testament and 27 books of the New Testament. Now let's go to St. John chapter eight, verse 58. Jesus said before Abraham was, I am. That's the same thing God told Moses through the burning bush. I am that I am. Now the reason why he was called the son, because he came to redeem us from my sins. So God had to come wrapped up in human form to shed blood because a spirit cannot die. A spirit cannot shed blood. A spirit doesn't have an earthly body. So in order for blood to be shed on the cross, God put off immortality, put on mortality, came wrapped up in human form as Jesus of Nazareth in a body. He came as a servant to redeem us from our sins because under the law of Moses, they used to offer up lamb's blood for the atonement of their sins. They used to go to the priest. Well, Jesus made it easier. He became that lamb. He offered up himself. He came in the human form to shed blood to redeem us from our sins. Blood had to be shed to wash away our sins so we won't have to die and go to a devil's hell. Now he's the Holy Ghost to the church. He's the father in creation. He became the son of redemption. And now he's the Holy Ghost to the church. One Lord, one faith, and one baptism.